is Beardo Cleaver. Welcome back to my channel. Hope you're doing most excellent today. Today we're listening to a Parkway Drive song called Vice Grip. Uh, I'm only familiar with Parkway Drive by name. I've heard of them. I've never listened to them that I know of. Uh, they're on Epitaph, or this song is from Epitaph, the label. So I'm expecting it to be in some some ballpark of punk. They probably played the Warp Tour at some point. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, this is a fresh listen. This is Parkway Drive, Vice Grip. Alright, nice echo on that guitar. Slam down! I don't know, I just find this type of metal cheesy, honestly. Metal. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, cool triplets there. Can't deny the, the catchiness. It's like... You know what it is? It's vocally Slipknot, like Corey Taylor. Uh, with... What was the hook? It was It was something. Like Van Halen, maybe? No, like Journey or some shit. Yeah, even that, uh, the like pause on the one where they go, but where they put the accent on the two. That's, I think, from the Slipknot song, too. That riff, guitar riff, is almost like Iron Maiden. It's like he's definitely a, a big fan of Iron Maiden, I think, because I could I could spot the influence in that. Cool setting that they're playing in. I would I would love playing in that a music video like that. I don't totally hate it. I don't. To I don't hate it. This. I might have been into this uh, when I was. I don't know. Okay, that's an all right riff. That just gained like this one, one, one letter grade. Okay, I'm gonna stop and talk about that. Yeah, yeah. The. Even though I said in, a, in an earlier video that I, I generally don't like the sound of uh, triggered drums, here I th it sounds triggered, but I still enjoy it. Like it, it fits with the sound, with the type of sound and vibe that they want to get out over with that riff, that the syncopated riff. Doo -doo, doo -doo, doo -doo, doo -doo, doo -doo. Yeah, it's, it's I'm I'm digging this part. Um, yeah. Uh, and going back to when I would actually listen to this, like the earlier parts of the song. It sounds like early 2000, like, Korn's been around for a while. Uh, yeah, it, it, it'll fit in that time period. Maybe it is from that time period. I don't know. This is a fresh listen. Let's continue. Parkway Drive, Vice Grip. It looks more modern than mid-2000s, though. Did they really jump? That's pretty cool. Lies? I hope they're saying lies and not lice. <laughs> okay, that, that... It is so fucking catchy, though. It's like... Definitely pop metal. It 
it's not something I would I would seek out to listen to, but I wouldn't mind if it was on. Yeah, I think is my overall uh, impression of the song. Yeah, if, if this was like at a, at a bonfire or something, and it happened to come on, I'd be like, I wouldn't ask to change it, I would just ask who this is. Yeah. I'd have a sucker for uh, twin guitar harmonies too. <laughs> it just needs to be faster, maybe? That's one of the things I would prefer. If it, just to. Yeah. Okay, well, not bad, not bad. Not bad. Yeah, that's cool how it fades out like that, too. I love a good fade out. Oh, man. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I guess I would call that metal. Like it wouldn't. It's not. It's more metal than punk. Definitely. Like, uh, but it does have that like that shot along uh, aspect of of punk as well. Yeah, You're not bad. Like I said, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Uh, when I'm when I'm craving metal, I I didn't didn't wouldn't put it on. But if it came on, I wouldn't object, definitely. So thank you to whoever uh, recommended that. If you guys have any other recommendations for me to check out any genre of music, punk, metal, rap, hip-hop, opera, country, barbershop quartet, please, I love barbershop quartet. Like, seriously, I love barbershop quartet. And I've I listened to a few videos, but uh, point is any genre, any genre, let me know in the comments below. That was Parkway Drive, Vice Grip.